Hello everybody, welcome to our channel. Monday and in Thailand, happy Loi Klatong. Um, it's been quite the weekend. Kiran was very sick over the weekend. So we stayed home the whole time. I actually went to go visit one of my friends that I met from the old company I used to work at. So it was really nice getting to hang out with her and see her. But for the most part, we were home because Kiran just was so weak. He could not get out of bed. So we just had to stay home and he had to get better, feel better, which he does now. He's in work, but he's still very weak. I don't know if he has a case of whatever's going around. I feel like there's something going around at the moment and there's just loads of people sick and loads of people have these funny coughs. So I'm asking him if we can do something tonight. There is something making a weird noise in him. I'm asking him if we can do something tonight to celebrate because who's to say we'll be here next year to celebrate Loi Katong, but I'm not sure. So we'll have to see about that. Um, but apart from that, I wanted I want to vent about my students, but I'm not. And yeah, really excited about this week and back for another weekly vlog. So happy Monday, guys and gals. So glad you're here. Um, it was fun. It was nice. It was good to let things go. It was an exciting Monday, if I do say so myself. Like, it's a school night and we're still out. We're waiting on the train at the moment um, to go back home. Kieran's ready. That's what he's going to do when he gets back home. I have a few admin stuff I need to do. <laughs> I have a few admin stuff I need to <laughs> I have a few admin stuff I need to get done anyways. But I love Mondays like this. Exciting. Oh, our train's here. Gotta go. Thank you, so much. See you tomorrow. <laughs> Hi, Kara. I just saw that. I'm freaking out. It just crossed the street mad casually. Like, it had business to get to on the other side. It was just like... <laughs> it's like Ratatouille vibes when it's just like, oh, it's Sally, excuse me. Like, Ratatouille doesn't have an English accent, does it? Oh, that's, that's so French. Was he American? <laughs> I don't remember what Ratatouille was, but that was really creepy. Very creeped out by that. John is coughing up a storm over here. Raise your hand if you need a haircut. <laughs> oh my god. Anyways, chill old Tuesday, not much crack. Um, I woke up in like a funny mood today, but I feel better now, which is nice. You know, you just kind of just wake up in the mood and you don't know why you're in that mood. So happy to be feeling better, anyways. Here on the telling you he had no three day at school. He hates Wednesday, so he's a his favorite day, so that's what he's not looking forward to. But that's our food we are cooking. I've been thinking about this all day. We ate it yesterday and I'm like I wanted to get it. Anyways, a food gym was here. Happy Tuesday. I love the fact that I was talking for like 10 minutes and I thought it was recording the whole time but it wasn't <laughs> oh my gosh technology is out to get me today technology is out to get me oh my days anyways happy Friday everybody um, I guess that was the first draft and here we'll go again. Don't know how completely vulnerable I'll be. We'll see what happens. Um, happy Friday. We definitely skipped Wednesday and Thursday. It's just been really busy. Life has been kind of hectic here. Um, most things have not changed with Kiran. He's still kind of having a hard time settling in. I am going to be very honest about the fact that I don't like the company he's working for. I think he would even say this and maybe a lot of people friends of me will say this i just feel like i'm very passionate about 
just like fairness like it needs to be fair for everybody like i feel like no one should ever be taken advantage of so even like when we go grocery shopping and like i see something that's like not okay or not fair i'm wanting to speak up regardless of like the situation and that's just who i am and i'm looking at this situation with him and his company and i just feel like they're taking advantage and i won't say any more than that um because we're still kind of in the middle of everything so hopefully when we get to the other side i can give you all the full tea but i still stand by everything i said because i'm not an employee of theirs and kiran is still showing up and doing the absolute best he can do every single day i'm so proud of him i'm the one that's in here like <laughs> um so yeah he's still moving through everything anyways and I don't know. I don't know if we even mentioned this in the video when we talked about moving out here. This year here was like meant to be this like, let's do it all. Let's try everything. Let's see what could come of the things that we are passionate about. So when I think for myself and how like, you know, my school is grand, I love, I love it. And of course I have my days, but I love it. And I've re like I've launched a group trip because I enjoy traveling, so I want to see what could come of that. I've opened an Etsy store because I love digital products. I want to see what can come of that, and it's just all these little things I feel like I've been tapping into because I'm like excited. These are the things I enjoy doing because I think a lot of my life I've gone through things that I don't really enjoy doing, and it's almost like I'm crossing them off of my list to be like, okay, I don't want to go back to that. Okay, I don't want to do uh, do that. But what are elements I can move from there and bring with me to whatever it is I end up doing full time? And a lot of people think maybe because um, I post a lot of social media or we're creators, like this is like my career and this is it um no i feel like content creation is just like a part of it it's a side of it and it's a great side like i love editing videos but it's not the full picture for me you know i just feel like there's so much more and that's what i'm tapping into and hoping to tap into i should say right now um and that's what i'm hoping kieran has space to tap into whenever the workload becomes less consuming um so yeah it's just been a really busy week in terms of like balancing that and balancing life in thailand and kiran is <laughs> he's sick again guys he's sick again yeah got another cold or whatever flu is going around so he's still kind of coughing at the moment i feel like every time we do a weekly vlog he just happens to be sick i don't i don't get it as well but he's sick again but he is on the mens and he didn't even take a sick day he went to work every single day even when he was sick like my man's a, oh, he's a fighter. Like, I love him. <laughs> um, yeah, it's been tough though. It's been tough in like complex ways that again, I cannot, I don't want to speak of uh, speak about it too soon. I'd rather be on the other side of it and kind of share all of that with y'all. But it's been good, if that makes sense. I keep thinking of all the different versions of reality this year could have looked like for us, whether it's been in Dublin or in America. And this is the reality I always choose, even in a different dreamland or world that I'm always in in my head. Thailand is always the reality I choose. So it's about moving through the different things that come up while we're here. Um, but I have cried three times today. <laughs> um i cried while they were doing my nail actually but i was like don't 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 let that tear fall you better not let that tear fall <laughs> and the tear didn't fall like legit it was sitting in my eye like right there i was like don't fall don't fall <laughs> um i think the tears stem from a place where i spend a lot of time in social media because i'm a content creator and a lot of the times I find myself comparing myself to other people when they're like, I'm doing this, I'm doing this, I'm doing that. And I think a lot of us can probably relate to that. So here, this is me being super vulnerable with you because I understand even where I'm sitting right now, like I'm extremely lucky to have a lot of things that I have. And I've also fought really hard to have some of the things that I have. And some people would, you know, would love this, but that's the weird 
social media kind of thing because you would never think about comparing yourself really to other people but then you get on like tiktok and instagram and then other people's lives are kind of in front of you that you can't help but compare yourself to other people so it's this like funny cycle of like i'm very grateful for everything i have then i get on tiktok and i'm like <laughs> So yeah, today is one of those days where I feel like TikTok kind of won and I got in my head and I was like crying, but I'm going to snap back into reality because I'm grateful for where I'm at and I'm grateful for everything, you know, that I've got and it's just those reminders and that's where like sometimes I really do need to take a break from social media and kind of like step away from it and that's why sometimes I'm like, can this actually be my job, like social media full time because can't really afford to do that unless you know you're the monets and the alex earls of the industry kind of you know um but yeah that's the we update anyways from the past two days it's not this actually what am i saying um, we got delicious we, got really good yeah. we decided wednesdays we're gonna go out and eat some western food to break up the week and yeah we we're just chilling yesterday and today's friday i have to do a border run tomorrow because my visa expires next week so we're headed down to malaysia tomorrow so that i can cross the thailand border and cross back in into the border on sunday it's only one night um so when you have to do a border run especially if you do a flight border run you have to be gone for more than 24 hours like it has to be the next day you come back but if you do a land border run it's a little bit different where you can go and come back the same day um so we just thought we'd make a trip out of it we're going to uh, um penang malaysia they have a nando's so i was like let's go let's go <laughs> and we're still like finalizing new year's plans and like every other bits in between we're doing at the moment so exciting times exciting things ahead we still don't have a thai bank account and that is tough but like i said there's like all these like little mini challenges that we find are like that's just pop it up but overall the overall feeling regardless of the things that come up regardless of the tears regardless of everything is gratefulness always grateful for you all watching you know grateful to just be here and grateful yeah to be here like when i think about like my life in general you know so yeah that's friday and i'll bring you all along this weekend for sure because you already know you come oh, you already know <laughs> but gonna do a takeout tonight for sure again gonna live life and i hope you do you like my nails I actually ended up liking them in the end. I was so sad. Okay, sorry. I'm going to go in a second. I was so sad because every time I did my nails in Ireland, I swear, like the way they took it off, put it back on, my nails were always just so like, like crisp. She took my nails off here and my nails were super bendy and flabbly. And I was like, I'm not used to this. I don't know. And I think my friends back in America always say that happens to their nails when they take it off. But maybe the nail techs in Ireland just do it different because my nails were thriving in Ireland. So if you're asking me what I miss about Ireland currently, it will be all nail techs. <laughs> anyway, so it's a super side note story just to kind of show you all my nail. And I got a wee pretzel afterwards because I was like, treat yourself. You wanted to cry so bad and then you held the tears together treat yourself <laughs> but i'm gonna go work on my etsy shop now as <laughs> uphill battle that one is <laughs> if anyone knows anyone who's a successful etsy shop owner please let me know let me send me a message <laughs> but outside of that sending lots of love to you all happy friday Bonus Friday content here on Sexy's Haircut. Look who it is. <laughs> We are.
in tom mang air for tom tom one tom one tom one are you sure it's tom one it's tom one i think it's tom mang no it's not tom mang he's tom one tom mang if anyone speaks thai can you let us know who's saying it correctly <laughs> tom mang yeah how are you i'm still coughing so annoying still coughing I need, give me some remedies. That's also, good. Don't tell me honey and lemon or whatever. Shut up. Also, also should we take a moment to appreciate his haircut? Oh. 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 Don't tell me ginger, don't tell me honey lemon. Doesn't do anything. Uh, I need real solutions. Also tell everybody where we're going where we're going. And why we're going. We're going to Malaysia, Penang. And we're going because I'm a romantic and I just planned a trip for just a quick one night getaway. That's what I do. And that's it. Just one night, gone today, back tomorrow. Uh, that's it. So, those are lies. Um, <laughs> we're at the airport and we're getting ready to go to Malaysia for the visa run. I'm not visa run, border run. For my visa that's expiring. Kiran had to get a re-entry visa because he is all set and good. He just has to have the entry. Again, Thai visas are a bit complicated if I'm being honest. But you have to get permission to leave and come back and still be in good standing essentially and not be a tourist. We had to do that and at first we thought we messed up this whole application process and that he did it all wrong and then he couldn't even leave the country with me. Like I already started imagining him crying like with me not there with him tonight because he had to stay in Thailand because he couldn't even come with me. <laughs> But it worked out. It worked out. <laughs> that was lies. I planned a romantic one night surprise get -around. At the most convenient time where my visa was about to expire, I guess. How romantic. Tell him to name the hotel we're staying at. <laughs> Let's see, let's see how. Anyways, from Dong Wang Airport, signing out. <laughs>
Not too bad. Carolyn's having a moment. Like I said, it's been a day. <laughs> so this is our room. I actually don't know how to get to the bathroom. Oh. Oh, hi, it's me. This is our bathroom. Oh my gosh. Talk about showering in front of our... Kieran, I'm gonna shower and you're gonna be there. He's not happy. He's not in a good mood. <laughs> okay, well. That's our place anyways, and... I think I see it. We didn't think we'd make it before the rain. Look at us. I think it's gonna start raining any second, but at least we got the view without the rain. Penang, Malaysia. It is much cooler up here. Yeah, it is. Not that it's really hot by right now. Oh, it's not a great time for you all to hear, sorry. <laughs> all right we're back home we've had dinner and mm. just happy to be back for yeah. a second i didn't think i'd be let in she was asking me lots of questions Ooh, <laughs> that was nervous. yeah i was a bit nervous because i saw two tourists actually yeah. get pulled to the side and they were questioned Ooh. even more but I got given my visa, so <laughs> I got given my visa, so all oh care on. So essentially, I got given another tourist visa to be here till January, but I won't need it because I'm going to do my final border run in two weeks to get the right visa I need to be here yeah. for the next little while. Um, it was just a little bit tricky coming to Thailand and doing it. Um, Ireland doesn't mm -hmm. have a Thai embassy to have done it before we got here and Caron's company was are just smoother with it I guess I don't know but mm. thankful anyways I'll be getting that done in two weeks so no more <clears throat> sorry no more border run anyways um and yeah we're here watching friends we're on season three and just feeling really really tired and just ready to sleep if I'm being honest um Kieran still has a cough. We stopped by the pharmacy to get him some antibiotics. Hopefully that'll help him. Mm. Um, here you can just go into the chemist and just get that. You don't need a doctor's prescription. <coughs> oh, here he goes. You don't need a doctor's prescription, which I think is super cool. Like the pharmacist is our bestie. So every time we go in there, she's always ready to help us. Um, Especially the amount of times we get sick. I know. We've seen her so many times since we've oh, arrived. It's ridiculous. It is a bit ridiculous. ridiculous. <laughs> um, and Kieran. One word, how are you feeling? Um, I can't be arsed. <laughs> I, 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 I feel that. Yeah, I think my overall feeling this Sunday is tired, both mentally and physically. Um, I'm, I'm feeling very tired. I think 
if I'm leaving I'll ending message here it'll be like take the breaks when you need to take it Kiran it would mm. love a break right now but we have That's Tuesday break, off yeah. we have Tuesday off which would be really good but I'm thinking like both like step away from social media if you ever need to like even that means I'm not what even if it means not watching our videos or like no. you know <laughs> take the breaks because oh, i know i, I will don't agree you know with that one. okay i know i will so do what you need to do to look after yourself is my definitely take a break but keep up with that oh god don't listen to him do not listen to him it we're gonna continue fun. okay we're gonna continue watching friends <sighs> happy sunday if there is such a thing. Oh my gosh. Happy Sunday. And thank you for tuning in to this week's vlog. Sunday. We're so happy you're here. So thank you. I think we're close to 1K actually. When did that happen? Freaking out about that. Thank you all for being here. And yeah, I cannot wait to celebrate that milestone um, wow. with you. And yeah, okay. Kiss them. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> bye. Oh, 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 okay. Bye, bye. Thank you for watching. And while you're here, don't forget to like and subscribe.